I'm going to time this with this so that we always know. That way we know. Let's see what our quest is. Look, owl post. Who sent us an owl? Who is this? Natty told me about your run-in with the poachers. I have some news about as well. Can we meet soon? I fear that some of what I uncovered has to do with you. <gasps> it has to do with us. It has to do with us. Let's go. Let us go. Another outfit. Bella! Sorry. I was just... Wow. I was not expecting that. Look, there's snow everywhere. It's so beautiful. Snow, snow, snow. So much snow, snow. So oh, that's one of those things. Let me get the one. <laughs> so I can teleport easily next time I'm around he here. Is. When's the last time you saw him catch a beast? You can learn a time you saw him catch a beast. I tell you this. He tells me this. We have arrived. Where's the woman? Hey, Poppy. Oh, there you are. Is High Wing all right? Natty told me what the two of you did. Yeah, it looked fine. High Wing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe. It's a her. I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want High Wing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. <gasps> I overheard them talking in the Hogshead, and did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you yep. on sight? I did know that. Have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the trial? I like your clothes. It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help. Especially I after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Horntail Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. No. Why? What is it? The poacher's best kept secret, apparently. Ooh. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. Is it the I Phoenix? I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making. At the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poacher spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you Let's ever meet there. my gran... This trip never happened. <laughs> not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. Why would I, I meet your her. gran? She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows wow. how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Because you will. Whichever that idea. <laughs> Which have a good or that idea. Which way? We need to go faster. Oh, it's that way. Okay. Happy Daisy. Oh look, it's a centaur. Oh look, another one. Tread carefully. They should not hurt child. An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We are against the poachers. With them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. Nice. We spoke with a centaur. Isn't that fun? <laughs> so exciting. He was certainly a charmer. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind. And the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? 
You're I human. I noticed the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. But they know we're students. That scared the shit out of me. That's the third time I've seen a dugbog behave that violently. Hmm, it seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. I've noticed I wonder why. Too. It's almost like there's something in the water. In the water? That's concerning. This is odd. What, what? is it? Not entirely sure. But look around. Vivellio. The poachers were here. Perhaps we can find out why. Investigate, bitch. Still smoking. They can't have been gone long. Pelts. Oh my god. Poor beasts. There's so much beasty stuff. Revelio. Not so saddy. What is this? This is goblin metal. Seems out of place in a poacher camp. I should tell Poppy about it. Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Anything interesting? Poachers were A couple. Here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. I don't have a good feeling about this. Are you How hurting or not? And poacher interests align. Wow, look at the castle. It's look so pretty. Down there. Definitely poachers. No creatures though. So what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Get a better lay of the land. Let's go. A unicorn? They have you. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I was so annoyed that I forgot to swallow. Oh shit, I forgot I don't have any potions. I should I should have gone. I should have gone and got some more. I forgot about that. I mean I wasn't supposed to tell everyone I was here. We we're supposed to be sneaky sneaky. Uh, but now I now I remember it. That no potions. We were supposed to have health potions and we have none because we just came from a boss fight. And we forgot to get more potions because we dumped them. So we should go. Where's the woman? Where were those two that saw me? Let's see. Who is that? Who is speaking? Sounds like a very mean person. Sneaky, 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 so sneaky. Very sneaky. I am so sneaky. Oh. Is someone? You'd think they were guarding the minister for magic himself. What is going on here? Only one way to find out. Tego. 
How is everyone so good at disillusionment charms? Harry Potter went seven years and I've never seen him. I mean, he has he had an invisibility cloak. Still, no one, no one uses disillusionment charm. Revenia. Oh my god. Oh my god, is that a dragon? Two! Oh my god. Are they making the dragons fight each other? That is so mean. Those poor things. It's a dragon fighting ring. This is Horntail Hall. The name makes sense now. And the secrecy. No wonder the poachers were in Hogsmeade so much. Likely taking pets and spreading the word. Given how crowded it is here, how could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard cotton. There must be more dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. Completely ignore the fact that something broke over there. Better be a beast. You better be a beast. Then a what victor was sinking straight in a bug. Oh. Oh. Can we not walk through whatever this is? I thought it was a door and I could just well. A look a restricted area. That's obviously why we want to do. Have you heard from your family? If you and your brothers come out to our way of thinking, going. will they join us? Nah, they say we go too far. The violence isn't gonna get us what we want. <laughs> I say, if every last wizard is run through with a blade, then violence is gonna get me from there. You know, before I send you. So, the ends petrify the means. Nice trophy. Pavelia. I need to put a point on the thing that allows me to run when I'm under a dissolution charm. Did you hear those goblins? Yeah. Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. I'm sorry, something's going on behind you? What's going on down there? <gasps> what are they doing? They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite the fight. Oh, the poor morning. thing. Brought with her chained up like that. Let's even her, shall we? One foot in front of the next and quiet as can be. Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hebridean from the looks of it. Can't leave it here, not with the plans they likely have for it. Can you please? Aloha, Mora. 
You walk so slowly. There, I opened it. Ah, it's under the fire. It's so cool. Put it on your sack. It's hot! Alright, I have the egg. Vivenia, the elements of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's make them count. Yeah, we have two po three potions. Oh, five. What? What I wouldn't give to be a demogite. Careful! Ragnarok will warn his dragon in town. Oh my god, are you serious? Pointing. Is that the last one? Nice. Is that? Oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Very weird. Free. This may have been a bad idea. I suppose we'll find out. Oh, wait. Ooh, that's a beauty. Nice. Wow, they don't know how to protego. Hey, hey, I have an egg. Look, I have your egg. <gasps> I 
And send your luck. Be free. That looked more like a wyvern than a dragon, but okay. Every time. This way. That was a Hebridean black. Hebridean black. What are we gonna do to, with a I dragon don't think egg? She knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. <sighs> what now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. <laughs> Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And what about that person in Augsburg? Cannot be good. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. We are it. Be careful, won't you? Defender of dragons. I am the defender of the dragons. My goodness, look at all those letters. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm bombarda. Once you have completed the task, I've set forth to speak to me in class. Professor Mc... I, I just... For me, that's Professor McGonagall. It's time you learn the transformation spell after you've completed your required task, which I'm certainly will prove useful in finishing air fill guide. Attend my class to learn a new spell. Afterwards, we will discuss your progress as far. <gasps> Can we meet at the three broomsticks? It may... Finally be safe since we rescued the dragon. I haven't heard anything to imply that the poachers are looking for the dragon egg. We do. And Sebastian. I've been studying Salazar's written spell book. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. Well, since we're here, why not meet uh, the puppy in the three roomstick? Something up there. Oh, here we are. I'm sure you had your reasons, but breaking into Alfred Lawley's home. What... Over here. This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I yep. think a collar is precisely what we found at that poacher camp. It looked like I've it. never known poachers to use anything like that before. The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar. And Professor Fig was genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Exactly. I think so. Merlin. I don't think the dragon we set free was wearing a collar, but we should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. That's a good plan. Where? That's a good idea. We need to see this through. I'll start Where are we going to look away. for it? There was something else that I wanted to discuss with you. Oh? I didn't want to press it before. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Why is he after you? Rookwood is working with Ranrock, and Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Vic had a port key that led us there after the dragon attack. It's a bit of a long story, and Fig had asked that I not speak of it yet. Goodness. You do tell a lot of stuff well, to a lot of people, though. It certainly helps to shed light on what we saw at the tent. Don't worry, I'll guard your secret as if it were my own. I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. I'll let you know when I have news of her location.
uh, Sebastian down. Revelia. Incendio. A wonderful aura. See why statues need to make some noise. My aunt has complaints. Oh. You're coming. Maybe he just left. Hey, Sebastian, what's up? You'll never believe what. What I did you discover in the spellbook we found in the scriptorium? Salazar Slytherin's spellbook was a little difficult to interpret, but fascinating. Evidently. He encouraged teaching dark magic at Hogwarts. Oh. Neither the Imperius <coughs> curse nor the killing curse was unforgivable during his time. He believed students Only the should be prepared to use dark magic when necessary, not to fear it. That's why we had to use Crucio to gain access to the scriptorium. He didn't want his knowledge shared with anyone who was afraid of the power of dark magic. It was hard to do, but casting Crucio was our only option. And I'm glad we did it. Because in the spellbook, I also found something else. References to a lost relic, which, from what I can tell, grants the holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. <gasps> Do you Fuck. think this relic might be able to see Anne? Precisely. I plan to search for this relic, but I don't think we should tell anyone. Especially Ominous. He wouldn't understand. He would. He's gonna be so I see mad. I no to involve Ominous. I'm glad you agree. When I know more, I shall send an owl. I see a reason. I bet you're gonna need to speak to our soul friend. Keeping this to ourselves for now is for his own good. I'll decide what's for my own good. Ominous. <laughs> we were just about to get some air. Care to join? You're a liar, Sebastian. I heard everything. You swore you'd never engage in anything to do with dark magic again. No, I didn't. I said I understood you wanting that. I'd never swear to give up on finding a cure for Anne. You don't know when to stop, do you? I know when not to stop. Leave this alone, Ominous. I'll be on my Leave way. Leave it alone, Ominous. <clears throat> Are you all right, I Ominous? I am not letting this go. Ominous, Sebastian meant well. I know what I heard. You knew I wouldn't agree with this. Going after that relic is not a good idea. Sebastian doesn't even realize it, but he's as irresponsible and reckless now as his parents were years ago. It's why he died. Oh. I knew his parents died, but I never heard what happened. Mr. and Mrs. Sallow were professors, spent nearly every waking moment in the cellar library, noses buried in books. Anne and Sebastian were upstairs when it happened. They heard a sudden crash and ran downstairs, but it was too late. Their parents had crumpled to the floor. A defect with the lamp in the cellar caused the room to fill with an undetectable toxin. Sebastian and Anne were helpless. They had no magic yet. What a horrible story. It is. That's why I can't understand Sebastian's recklessness. I've practically lost Anne. I cannot lose Sebastian too. Please avoid anything to do with that spellbook. Those references in the book seem promising. Everything to do with Salazar Slytherin seems promising until it's too late. I hope Sebastian pursues this no further. But if you think he might, please let me know. Okay. It would mean a lot. It would mean a lot. 
I'm so disappointed with my friend though. Okay, I need to sleep. Even though I'm hungry and I think I should eat. But I kinda need to sleep. I shall return to sleep now. Okay, we should save. Save the There we go. Thank you for today. I hope you 